Well, developing right now, a child is recovering tonight after being struck by a bullet that came out of nowhere. It happened last night while the eight-year-old and his family were relaxing inside their home. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig is on Detroit's east side with how all this unfolded. They were just children happy and playing until they heard a noise, got down on the ground, and one of them, an eight-year-old boy, couldn't get back up. They were in a bedroom on the second floor of this house on Evanston on Detroit's east side, and the little boy had been shot, hit by a bullet that came from outside through a wall. Entering the home through a closet, exiting the other side of the closet wall, striking the child in the neck. Police say the bullet stopped just millimeters away from the eight-year-old spine. He was rushed to a nearby hospital where at last check he was in critical condition. His parents by his side wondering what permanent damage has been done to their little boy, all because police say it appears to be what they're calling a stray round. In other words, we believe that somebody somewhere in a nearby vicinity was uh, basically just firing off rounds, most likely into the air. A reckless act that could have cost this little boy his life. This is not like a, a video game. This is not TV. When that round or that bullet exits the end of your gun, the end of that barrel, it goes somewhere. Whether it strikes the target that you're aiming at or it does not, it keeps going until something eventually stops that round. And these rounds that do go up come down sometimes with the same velocity that it left that barrel with. And this is one of those situations where we're seeing something of that nature happening. Detroit police are continuing to talk to people in the area of 94 and Outer Drive, hoping for information that might lead them to the person responsible. In Detroit, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.